Bye. We're out here late at night. Sydney found a little dog. <laughs> she doesn't want to leave the little puppy, the little baby. And we don't, I don't know what to do. I wish she had food. What can you give her? Nothing. What would you guys do? I don't know who to call. Come here. She's, yeah, she's tired. Mm -hmm. That baby's tired. Guys, I don't know what to do. She's sweet. She's a sweet baby, too. And she, I think she's kind of limping a little bit. Well, what is the non-emergency number? Is it 4-1-1? 4-1 is not information? No. And it looks like she doesn't want to walk anymore. So we're going to walk through the neighborhood. But she's not walking anymore. She doesn't want to walk. And when we leave her, she comes to our door. Come on. like she's limping a little bit could be old but she's friendly she looks well kept she has a um leash you know a thing around her neck but there's no tag people need to tag their dogs Shh, mom, it's in the middle of the oh, night. well maybe to wake someone up yeah people need to tag their dogs Gotta be careful. Then you have a lost dog. That's someone's baby. Come here. Come on. So, I don't know. This may not even be how little cold is at. Yeah. I don't know, guys. It's late. It's 11 o'clock at night. Hey y'all. Uh, we're gonna see the status of the dog. Put the dog in the garage last night. We we're messing with the dog to like two in the morning. Hey! Hi! Hey, princess. Hi, pretty girl. Hi, pretty girl. Come on. Come on, pretty girl. Oops. Come on. You go. Come on. Okay, guys. Let me talk about how I look, okay? It's been a long night. A long night, okay? Look. did not get a new dog. Sydney found the stray last night when she got home from some church, something. And I'm not an animal person. <laughs> but she is so sweet. Look at her. Come on. Come on, pretty girl. Come on, pretty girl. That's a pretty girl. Come on. Come on. Pretty girl. That's a pretty girl. Yeah. I know, sweet girl. You miss your mommy. You miss your mommy, don't you? I know you do. Sit. Sit, sit. Sit, sit. I know you miss your mommy. I know. So she's been in our garage. We put her in the garage because we were afraid that she was going to get hit by a car or something. And I just couldn't live with that. <laughs> so a neighbor brought us a leash and we were able to get her into the garage. She's super, super sweet. And she didn't like that. She's an inside dog. 
She didn't like being in a garage. She wants to get in the house. We're not allowed animals. You know, I didn't pay for an animal. And um, I still want one her in the house anyway. So we put in the garage. We call animal control. <clears throat> Who knows how long they're going to be. So I don't know. And I don't know what to tie her to. <laughs> so I'm stuck on the leash. So I made me a cup of coffee. Brought out my computer. So maybe I could get some editing done. Shh, this dog kept us up until about 2.30 this morning trying to figure out what to do. So I don't know. She's so sweet. She keeps panting. It's not that hot. We gave it. She won't drink the water. She drank water yesterday. She won't drink it today. And she's old and she keeps limping. So I think it's not limping from an injury. I just think it's age, you know. But she doesn't look like she was hit by a car or anything. She, it doesn't look like, she just looks old. But she is the sweetest girl. Yes, it's a sweet girl. Yes, you are. You're so sweet. And she's very well kept. She's clean. Even her teeth are clean. Because I've seen some dogs with neglected teeth and even her teeth are clean. And um, she, she's in pristine shape. She's well loved. I know, pretty girl. I know. That's your good girl. Right? You are a pretty girl? Yes, you are. That's a pretty girl. Yeah. I wish I knew her name. And when I would put the leash on her, no fussing. It was like that's part of her routine. But the tag is gone. She has no tag on. It looked like it fell off or something. So I guess this is how we're going to spend our morning, Sydney. She went to church. They have some little function for high school students. So I don't know how long animal control is going to be. Come on, girl. No, no. It's okay. She heard a noise and she's skittish. Any noise, she's she ready to run. But if um, Bobby comes out, Sydney comes out, she'll go right up to him. She loves Bobby. Bobby has a good spirit with animals. She's like an animal whisperer. So the animals, or most animals, gravitate to Bobby. So the neighbor brought her some food and um, she won't eat it. We gave her some canned chicken, like canned tuna, but it was chicken. She tore that up. We warmed it up just a little bit. She tore that up, but she does not want the dry dog food. She won't touch it. So I'm thinking that she's a wet dog food type dog. Any little noise, she jumping out of her skin. Poor baby, baby girl. Hey, pretty girl. Hi. And with the leash, I don't know what to tie it to. I tried to tie it to a chair. I thought the chair was heavy enough. She started dragging the chair around the ground. <laughs> so I don't know what to tie the darn the darn leash to. I I don't know. I don't have anything heavy enough in the garage. I don't know, guys. And we wanted to walk her in the neighborhood across from us, but she just looks like she's in pain. So, like, a long walk is not going to work for her. Like, she just wants to lay down or sit down. And when I went inside to make my coffee, child, she was barking like, come back, come back out. Either let me in or you get back out here. <laughs> so hopefully animal control will be on their way soon. Okay. Look, I don't rescue no dogs. That's not my thing, but she was so sweet. It's, she just broke, she just broke all our hearts. We couldn't do, we couldn't leave outside. So. And this would be the day to own the show. Oh, so you got a dog now? No. <laughs> All right, guys. I will keep you posted. Hopefully, Spot. She has spots. She has a pretty. She's pretty. 
hopefully Spot will find her way home. Well, I'm going to sit here and drink my coffee. Try to get some editing done. See, I was editing last night. Minding my business. And then here comes Spot. Blowing up our Spot. What would you do in this situation? Would you have taken the dog in or just left it outside? On oh, the real world, I probably would have left her. But Sydney couldn't take it. She was like, Mom, I can't. Girl, she's not coming up in here. And then we all just fell in love with her. What would you have done? And it was, I don't know, I think animal control here, one place doesn't open till 11. And I don't know what time it is. It's like 9.30 in the morning. So, we tired. We're tired. And then I was concerned. I hope she was okay in the garage. We left the fan on in the garage. And we left the garage um, door cracked. I know dogs, they can do heat. It's not very, very hot today. So, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, pretty girl. Pretty girl. Hey, pretty girl. Say bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Yeah, I know. That's a good girl. Yes, she are. You a sweet girl. Guys, we're still out here. We've been sitting out here for an hour and a half. Right, Bobby? You gonna be sad to see her go, Bobby? Yeah? What happened last night, Bobby, when the lady stopped by our house? Oh my god. Yeah, we were outside, me and Sydney, and she was walking her dog, and then she saw, like, the dog at the end of our driveway. So then she was like, she came up to our door, and she was knocking on the door. She was like, is this your dog? Is this your dog? And then we were like, no, we found her like an hour ago, blah, blah, blah. And then she was like, okay. And then she was telling us how we need to bring her inside and, and this and that. And then she had her dog with her and the dog was like drinking the water. And she was freaking out about it. It was so funny. But, I don't know, then she came back again later. Because there was a bowl of water outside that we sat outside for the dog. And she didn't want her dog drinking it. <laughs> but. But what did she do when she kept drinking it? She kept yelling at the dog and then like yanking her leash away from it. It was. What did she say? Because her dog's name was like Cookie or something. So she just kept yelling like, Cookie, get over here. It was so funny. <laughs> I'm so tired. She's trying to, she's trying to get my chips. Mm-mm. Go eat that dog food right there. Mm-mm. Okay, maybe one. No more. You gotta watch your figure, honey. Sit down, Spot. Her name is Spot. I called her Spot. Cause she got spots. Sit. Up, sit. Sit. You know you old. You don't know sit. All right, that's my girl. She got it. You got it, girl. You got it, girl. Guys, we took the leash off the door. We called about four to five places. They saw my old, you need an appointment. An appointment to bring in a straight dog, and I don't do animals. And I was gonna put this thing in the car and drop her off somewhere. Oh no, we can we could get out there next week. Excuse me. Or uh, you you have to go online and make an appointment. But it's not my dog. I gotta do all. You're not getting no more of my chip spot. Look out! Look out! <laughs> Bye. These are my munchos. You got dog food, bro. Wait a minute. Here's spot. Ew, she just slobbered on my pants. Jesus. You make my nerves bad. Why are you staring at me, bro? 
to do. Why are you staring at me? <laughs> to drop you off at the post office. You think that'll work for you? Where you come from? So we took the chain, we took the leash off of her, and she won't leave the garage now. So now she's sitting by my feet. Hey girl. I don't got no animals for reason. And then I would think, if you're the owner, at this point, I don't even know what time it is, I don't got nothing. At this point, when you know your dog is gone, you will follow the protocol. Let me try the next door neighbor app. Let me try the animal shelter. Let me call these places, because they'll be like, oh no, someone called to report the dog. White with brown spots. Right? Nothing. So obviously the owner's not that concerned and I know the dog didn't come from too far away. And I would walk her to the neighborhood but she's old and you can tell she's, she's limping a little bit. So a lot of walking is probably not good for her. I don't know. I took the leash off, she won't leave so I'm about to go back in the house. What would you guys do? I, I don't know. Y'all want it all? Obviously she's up for grabs. But why you keep looking at me with those puppy dog eyes? Guys, what am I gonna do? She keeps looking at me. I can't have no dogs here, Spot. I, I don't understand. How old are you? You got the Alzheimer's? That's what you got? Because I probably walk off and won't know how to get back home myself, so I understand. Spot. See, you already know your name. Lord. Please help this dog find his way home and back to his owner. She's just the sweetest pie. I never knew I'd have a dog. I guess God say here is one for ya. <laughs> I know, pretty girl. That's a pretty girl. You're the prettiest girl ever. Oh Lord, where's your owner? You can't stay here another night. Mm -mm. That made us. That made our all of our nerves bad. Sydney done abandoned you. Bobby abandoned you. It's just me and you, kid. What are we gonna do? There she go again with those eyes, y'all. See? See? Mm -mm. Bobby wants to leave. She don't want to be here. No, I'm gonna stay until they You're gonna stay, Bobby. Look yeah. at her tail wagging. That's a happy baby. That's a happy baby. I gave us some nice cold water. Oh, yeah. I guess she likes her water cold, honey. She bougie. She's bougie. Okay, Spot. Somebody's coming to get you. It's gonna be so... Ooh, Lord. I just woke up. It's gonna be so sad, Mom. <laughs> So you already given her a name and everything. I did. That's so I guess I try to put a little note back in next. Is this them? <gasps> oh, oh see, they look nice, guys. Oh, they going? Oh, maybe not, that's not them. No, it definitely. All right, so just in case <laughs> we're not gonna record.
We'll give you an update after. Bobby, why are you looking so sad? Spot is gone from her spot. Was that sad? Yeah, but they were nice people, so I'm not worried. Like they, oh my gosh, they were so sweet yeah. and so patient. I mean, she was just great. She, the lady looked like. Do you remember? I, for my older people, do you remember the original Carrie? Um, Carrie. The scary movie. I don't know the actress's name. I guess everybody knows her as Carrie. I wonder if that ball is how. Anyway, let's stay on topic. That's how the lady looked. She looked like an older but well kept Carrie. She had like a um, like what do you call that look? That earthy look. Hippie. Yeah, she had like a hippie look. The husband was. Oh my God, the husband. You can feel their spirits like. I want to be friends with them. Their energy and their spirit was just beautiful. I don't care. This may sound a little crazy to y'all, but I can feel a person's spirit. I can feel good spirit, and I'm like, mm, I didn't, I didn't like how that made me feel. That's they're not good people. I can feel a person's energy, and them, they exuded love and positivity all through. Did you get that? Yeah, I did. Like, mm -hmm. As soon as they like got out, I was like, yeah, they got out of the car. They both kneeled down. The man, and they said sometimes dogs have issues with men, so they think that maybe the dog was abused. Um, loud, you know, any uh, sharp sounds or anything like that. The dog is scared. And she was like, yeah, that that sign of abuse. And she said, and the guy said a lot of times that abuse comes from the men. So I don't know, maybe men are more aggressive, so I don't know, but he stayed away. So once he realized how the dog behaved around him, he backed up. Like, they knew their stuff. Yeah. They said they, they rescue dogs all the time. So they're going to take her to see if she's chipped and just take it from there. Hopefully, well, I can, we can text we can text them. Yeah, we have their number mm -hmm. and check in again. But they were really nice people, so honestly, I'm not worried. It yeah. seemed like they knew what they were doing. They've done it before, like they said. So, yeah. Mm. And I didn't want them to feel uncomfortable with the blogging, so yeah. I felt as though it was best just to turn the camera off. And I, everyone is not receptive to vlogs, so being, you know, so out of respect for them. But he's gone. I wish you guys would have snuck and did it with your phone. I tried. I knew it was okay. He turned around and I was like, oh, never mind. So you got a little bit? No, I don't think so. Yeah, you, you wouldn't have known if it was just up like that. Yeah, I didn't. Anyway, all right, well, that's our experience with the doggy. Spot. Stop. You said you gave him her. Why? Getting all attached. Mm hmm. She was so sweet. Mm hmm. Alright guys, give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Until next time.